I'm going to do a few assessments. Is that all right? Skin assessment. Client has skin tone that is congruent with her ethnicity. Skin is warm and dry except for peripherals, especially bilateral lower extremities, which are exhibiting pallor and coolness to touch. Some freckling and nevi are evident throughout. Presence of confluent liver spots along forearms and hands. Birthmark noted on lower back, tan in color. Scars present on chest, possibly related to bilateral mastectomy. Discrete cherry angiomas present along trunk. Varicosities present in lower extremities. No abnormal lesions or nevi noted on skin. Hair and nail assessment. Client has curly gray hair. Hair is coarse and thin in texture with an even distribution on head. Scalp is clean and free of lesions and pests. Some dandruff present. Nail assessment. Client's nail surface is slightly curved with no notable presence of spooning and or clubbing. Nail beds are minimally cyanotic. Fingernails have longitudinal ridges present and exhibit some brittleness. Toenails are yellowed and thickened. Client presents with slowed capillary refill in bilateral upper and lower extremities. Head and neck assessment. Head assessment. Client has round and symmetrical normal cephalic head. No visible or palpable masses or nodules noted. No tenderness or trauma evident. Abnormal swellings and ticks absent. Neck assessment. Client's neck is subtle with limited range of motion. Marked vein neck distension present. Carotids without bruits on auscultation. No evidence of cervical lymphadenopathy or masses. Trachea midline and thyroid, thyroid not palpable. Eyes, ears, nose, and mouth assessment. Client has brown eyes, symmetrical. Conjunctiva are transparent and sclera appears white in color. Cornea is transparent, smooth, moist, and glossy, surrounded by arcus sinivus. Client's iris appears flat and round with visible details and even coloration. Perla. No erythema or drainage present. Upper lids have folds of redundant skin, but lids do not droop. Wrinkles and crow's feet around the eyes. Client has bilateral central visual acuity deficit and wears corrective lenses. Ear assessment. Client has pendulous earlobes with linear wrinkling. No piercings observed. Pinna appears symmetrical in size are, and are the same skin tone as face and neck. No tenderness to palpation. No discharge masses or lesions noted. Client shows signs of presbycusis as evidenced by difficulty hearing room conversation and whispered voice bilaterally. Both canals are clear cerumen. Both tympanic membranes appear gray white, slightly opaque, and dull. All landmarks are visible and no perforation noted. Nose. Client's nose appears to be symmetrical and midline. Nasal mucosa is pink and moist. The nasal septum is midline. Nares are patent bilaterally. No tenderness to sinuses upon palpation. No polyps or bleeding noted. Mouth. Client's lips are symmetrical, minimally cyanotic, pale, and dry. No lesions noted. Oral mucosa and gingivae are pink. Teeth appear uniformly yellowed. Receding gingival margins noted. Uvula rises midline on phonation. Tongue is smooth pink and protrude midline. No lesions noted. Chest assessment. Client has minimal but symmetrical chest expansion. Breathing is labored and client exhibits tripod positioning. Client shows signs of shortness of breath, dyspnea on exertion and rest. Coarse bilateral crackles widely dispersed over lung fields, but more prominent in the bases. Client exhibits productive cough with white frothy sputum. Increased tactile fremitus notice. Dullness evident on percussion. <laughs> Cardiac assessment. Client has diminished pulses in bilateral lower extremities and resting tachycardia. S3 gallop heard upon auscultation with a left shift, shift in point of maximal impulse. Bilateral dependent pitting edema, three plus noted in feet and ankles. No sign of bruit upon auscultation of carotid artery. 
abdomen assessment. Client's abdomen is symmetrical, but exhibits distension related to obesity. Bowel sounds are present and normal active in all four quadrants. No marked pulsations or visible peristalsis noted. Dullness heard upon percussion of abdomen. No abnormal bulges or masses present upon palpations. No rebound tenderness observed. Fluid wave present. Musculoskeletal assessment. Client exhibits no swelling, pain, or crepitus noted at TMJ. No tenderness, swelling, or masses noted on joints. Some pain in bilateral lower extremity joints, more so on the right side. Upper extremities of equal strength with no restriction in range of motion. Limited range of motion in lower extremities with left extremity stronger than the right. Swelling of bilateral lower extremities. No visible joint deformities. Neuro assessment. Client is A and O times four. Slow, wider, limping gait observed. Negative Romberg sign noted. Intact sensation to light touch. Intention tremor observed. 